I can't see what is being recorded. So I'll just try to line up as best I can. And uh, it's the 20th of May. Twenty seventeen, and uh, I'm out on the patio. It's a beautiful day. I'm thinking about um, weather conditions in Toronto, or it must be hot in Tampa <laughs> or Georgia. Nice, but uh, I'm drunk, or pretty much on my way. I probably should cut back a lot. But we'll see what happens. I'm kind of in a flux, you know. I fought it to the bitter end to the Supreme Court. But just because even they didn't get that right vis-a-vis -vis the Constitution that they're supposed to be enforcing. Uh, it left me, just, I don't want to say bitter, but uh, convinced it's all about the money. And I don't know if these court, or this court, the Ninth Circuit, was trying to protect Judge Jury because she had been uh, reversed by me in 2006. And so it wouldn't look good for one of their upcoming judges to be reversed twice by a guy who's not a lawyer. But that's not what they're supposed to do. They're supposed to enforce the law. Congress will make the law and you guys will interpret it, but you cannot take shortcuts and say, we don't need to hear this guy. We are so smart. This is the Ninth Circuit. We are so smart that we don't even need to see the guy or ask one question, and we can tell you what he's up to. I mean, give me a break. The uh, spiritual people talking to the dead people have more credibility than you guys. You got it? All right. I don't want to get upset. That's it.